This guy trying to hog the whole bed on me. What are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing, bunch of bunch? There's a pool party outside of my building today, so we're just gonna go outside and see what's up, see what's happening. All right, let's go. All right, got Buster locked and loaded in the Buster Mobile. We gotta come up with a name for this. Buster Mobile for now. All right, hit it. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Three of the hottest guys on social media, that's what we got right here. Delete this vlog for sure, I'm gonna have to delete it. Why are you gonna delete it? Because it was, I thought it was about to get turned, but it didn't get turned at all. We're gonna get turned now. So it's 7, 7 15 a.m. I just got off the phone with the vet. Um, and uh, we're going to rush Buster to the hospital, to the vet, to get his vital signs taken. I just gave him his medicine for the day. It's stressful. <laughs> okay, buddy. You'll be okay, buddy. You'll be okay. So, Buster has a condition with his heart, and his heart is pumping. The valve in his heart is not closing all the way. Like a normal valve will close like this, and then open back up as it's pumping. His didn't. So, it, blood would go backwards into his heart, and start to enlarge the valve in his heart. So he has this severely enlarged valve in his heart where now blood starts pooling in it and um, there's nowhere for the fluid to go but to his lungs. Well, it looks like my battery is on low. I was explaining it, but this is an emergency, so I'm just gonna have to fill everybody in when we get back from the vet. It's been about a year and a half um, when he went through heart failure the first time. That's when we discovered. I, I didn't know what was happening to him then. You know, I had to rush him to the emergency hospital and gave him the medication that I give him now every day. Um, and I've known that his condition would get progressively worse and worse as time went on. Uh, let's just hope it's not that time yet for him, but uh, I had to leave him at the vet for the day. I mean, Buster, Buster's my best friend, you know? Like, it's... I mean, that's what a dog is, right? Man's best friend, and he's been there for me through the toughest times.
I'm definitely not ready to say goodbye to him yet. Let me collect myself and I'll explain to you what exactly <laughs> I was trying to explain in the car before my camera died. I've just been uh, trying to distract myself all day. <laughs> well, it's only 10 a.m. It seems like it's been all day, but I'm cleaning my desktop, I'm editing, I'm even getting a new ringtone for my phone. I just keep thinking about him. Oh, hello? Curtis? Yeah, hi. Sorry, I, I, can you hear me? Yeah. I was calling you, I wanted to let you know how Buster's doing. How's so, he? You know, I'm concerned because although he's, um, his lungs sound a little clearer after the couple doses of Lasix, um, I can hear a pretty dramatic arrhythmia and he's still breathing um, very rapidly. So, um, you know, I'm a little concerned right now that we're in a kind of a refractory or uh, a heart failure that's not responding to treatment very well. But I would very much like him to go um, to access and see his cardiologist today if you are comfortable doing that for him. Yes, absolutely. And, um, so give me 30 minutes and we'll have him ready to go and access should be expecting you um, to go in through the emergency service and then to see Dr. Zimmerman sometime today. Okay, thank you. All right, we'll see you soon. Yep, bye-bye. Bye -bye. I don't know what that means, but it doesn't sound very good. Um, hopefully it will just be an expensive emergency room bill. They're right down the street, so I've got to wait a couple more minutes, and then, uh, then I'm going to head out. I don't know what to do with myself at all. He's... He's all I have, you know, he's my best friend and I... <laughs> I'm not ready for this. Not ready for it. He's such a great dog. <laughs> I gotta get myself together because I might just be getting emotional for no reason. You know, he might be okay. Here goes. I'm being such a such a mom right now. I'm like packing toys and treats and stuff for him. Get it together. <laughs> All right, we got Buster in the car. And I got a little treat for you. No, you don't want it? All right, let's get you to the, let's get you to the hospital. I just ran in. They had a bunch of people come in and rush Buster to the back, so, um, now I just have to wait and see what happens. So, hopefully he's okay. Okay, well I just spoke with the doctor and it seems like uh, they're gonna have to keep him overnight tonight and possibly tomorrow night. So, um, I'm gonna go out front and check out and then we're gonna go see him before we leave. Uh, but hopefully this, hopefully this is good news, we'll see. Hi, Buster. Hi, can I pet him? Yeah, you gotta pet him. Hey, buddy. How are you? I know, I know. Can I leave a toy with him? Yeah. I can? But it's just not guaranteed that it'll come I don't out. care. Okay. I don't care. Yeah, go for as it. As long as he's got a toy. Hold on there, Buster. Let me get you a toy real quick. <laughs> It's okay, buddy. Have you had him since he was a puppy? No, I adopted him. Aww. Yeah, Aww. I'm just gonna leave. I'm gonna leave the ball there, there for you. Okay, buddy. I'll be back tomorrow. I promise. Uh, I hate leaving him like this, but. <laughs> Hi, 
He looks lively though. He's an oxygen. <laughs> yeah, he's running on straight oxygen. We need to get you some of this oxygen, huh? Buster's gonna stay here overnight. He looks a lot happier now. Um, well, <laughs> you know he's scared and he's nervous and he hates being away from me. He's very attached. But uh, at least he's he's more upbeat and lively with the oxygen, which is great to see. They're gonna make sure that his lungs get cleared up and then hopefully tomorrow, um, if they're not ready to release him yet, then I'll, I'll stop by to at least visit him. I don't even know what I'm saying. He's in good hands, for sure. So, um, fingers crossed, we'll be back tomorrow. Now I can vlog. Lele and Onana hit me up. Let's go, let's check it out. Hey guys, welcome to Curtis's vlog. He's the fucking best, guys. If you don't know him, you're gonna get to know him. He's awesome, and he's a wonderful man. All right, all right. <laughs> my turn. <laughs> my name's Alyssa, and I'm I didn't Curtis. say my name, my name's Inez. Hey, guys.